Okay, so that, that's this. Contemporary learning theory is based on the idea of constructivism. As they learn, individuals construct knowledge and understanding based on what they already know and understand, which is called prior knowledge. Okay, I did the airplane thing for you guys, all right? Okay, good. <laughs> so, I'm, if I'm teaching these kids about aerodynamics down at the school, and I want them to be all on the same page, I want them to construct knowledge based on what they already know. So I've got to get them on an even keel. Uh, so I'll, I'll ask them, and I'll ask you guys, how many of you uh, flown on a plane? Raise your hands. Okay. How many of you haven't? Raise your hands. You didn't do anything, bro. You're not, you didn't, have you been on a plane? Okay, so you need to participate, all right? Those of you that haven't been on a plane, have you seen one in the sky? Yes, okay. Have you seen one turn in the sky? Does it do, does it do this? Or does it kind of dip? Okay. So now I've got everybody on the same page as far as you know flying goes, but I want to teach the kids about a thing called drag, okay? And that's important in aerodynamic design. So like a, a, a rocket, the nose cone is built at a you know circular thing. Why is that? Why do you think that is? Less drag. Less yeah, less drag, but it, it's, so it cuts through the wind better right what's track have you ever been in your car you're driving down the road with the window down you put your hand out it goes like that right then you go wee like that right i hope i got that on film <laughs> you're driving out go you know it goes like that and then you turn your hand and you go wee 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 right that's drag when it's doing this this is that's drag okay so that's so now I can get everybody on the same page that kind of understand what I'm going to be talking about as far as rocket design goes. And then I can use educational technology. There's an app on the phone here called Wind Tunnel, okay? And it's a, it's a, it's a, a app that kind of mirrors what NASA does, okay? And you can draw stuff on it. You can draw. I usually do it, but I have to use that phone to record with today, but I, so I can't show it. But... Um, I'll show it. I'll show it another day. So I then I'll tie in that app and I'll let the students get their phones out, play with that for a while. They can calculate drags. They can design uh, nose cones and so forth and so on. So this is kind of what all this stuff's leading to is this construction and understanding based on what they already know and understand. Okay.